Hi everyone, welcome the newest member of the family. This is Nala, she is a rescue dog from Hurrah. We'll put the link down below because they've been amazing by the way. They are an incredible charity that uh, take dogs in that yep. have been um, at the pound too long or are on death's door and uh, they help train them, foster them, uh, de-sex them and then um, rehome them yep. and they also put dogs on seven day trials which is what we've had with Nala, a seven yep. day trial yep. and we decided to keep her after that. We wanted to go with a trial because Plum is obviously a member of this family as well and her reaction to the dog was going to be very important to us. Uh -huh. um, we wanted to get a rescue dog for a long time um, and we wanted to get a dog. Ow! We wanted to get a dog, not a puppy. <laughs> and look what we have, a puppy. But we were told by many, many experts that puppies are there much easier to get along with a cat than a dog. Try yeah. and train that even if the dogs live with the cat for a long time. So we got a puppy for plum's sake. Uh, this little girl was left at a park uh, at three weeks old to die alone. We don't know where the rest of her litter is, where her mum was. Um, she was just left at a park. So. Um, somebody picked her up and gave her over to Hurrah to help rehome and so we have taken her in. Yeah, so because of that we're not 100% sure how old she is but we think roughly she's 16 weeks old. She is, and because she was abandoned in a park we're not 100% sure of her breed but two breeders and two vets have said that she's got Staffy in her which yeah. you can tell. So she, we believe she's a Staffy cross. With Crossed with what? We don't actually know. It could be multiple breeds. Yeah, it could be a bit could boxer. Could be a bit boxer. Could be a bit lab. She's nuts. She's pretty small because we've been doing some puppy preschool, which she's very good at. Yeah. We're doing puppy preschool and um, the other dogs like Golden Labs um, and Golden Retrievers are much bigger than her at the same age. So we, she looks like she'll be a rather small dog, which is exciting. We're thinking maybe 22 kgs max, fingers crossed. And yeah, with her reaction to Plum, we're taking it very, very, very slowly. We've looked up probably every single website, read every book that we possibly can. Uh, she's gonna stay on a lead around Plum mm. for a few weeks and uh, she stays in her crate. It's been good. We wanted to make sure there was no aggression towards Plum mostly. Um, and it, it, there isn't. If anything, there's curiosity and she wants to play, but obviously we're not letting her chase Plum. Uh, and Plum's been very curious. Plum will watch us play with her in the garden and um, you know, she doesn't love her yet. <laughs> Plum's not like cuddling up to her, but that is the hope and the dream that one day they will. But Plum's got the curiosity. When Nala's asleep in her crate, Plum, where, you know, Plum wanders around the house and she sort of chills underneath the chair for a bit and stares at the crate, but then she'll wander over and sniff it. She's not scared of Nala. She's just very, very cautious, which we knew she would yeah. be. But we do believe that, um, you know, Plum just needs to bat Nala on the nose to okay. tell her who's boss. And hopefully they'll be best friends, eh? Yeah, we want to talk about uh, getting Nala and Hurrah and adopting rather than going for a cute breed. I mean, in the end, all dogs that are born need homes, whether that's pedigree or left at a rescue place. What is it? The Those in need are the best breed. Yeah, that's a that's what we think. So. Um, she's just a little mutt that we have no idea what yeah. she's made up of. Uh, we don't exactly know her age, but um, she's been going to puppy school with a few Labradors and Gone Retrievers, yeah. and she's been doing extremely well. Should we show her tricks? Yeah. Okay. We um, just need the treaties. We'll show. We'll show what she can do. Sit. Sit. Look at me. Good girl. Down. Good girl. Hey, what a good girl. So obviously we're not we're not dog experts. We're learning as we go. We've never had hello. We've never had a puppy before. If you are pretty well, you know, you've got a well-trained dog, or you know much about dogs, or if actually, if you know breeds, what, what is, is she? What is she? What are you? Hey. But I mean, we love we love help. We love comments. So put them down below. But this is Nala, and she, she is, is a part of the family. We've got a rescue cat and a rescue dog now. Yeah. Um, and if anything like the rescue cat, hopefully she'll be very, ah, very good. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, you'll be seeing a lot more of Nala and that is why this video is a week late because oh my God, it's been chaos trying to look after a puppy for the Ooh. first week, but. We got her, we got her last week on a Friday, but on the Saturday she was, she was very, very sick. So we didn't really get much time with her on the weekend because she had to stay overnight uh, at a vet. She had to get an IV drip. It was all very sad and scary. She got an infection up her nose from something that had happened a, a few days before we got her, because we thought we had done something, we'd done something. We, were, we were heartbroken. So she's fine, she had a whole bunch of stuff pumped into her, and now she is a manic little thing. Come here. Um, get your chew. Get your chew. Or lick the end of the table. This is Nala, she's our dog. 
If you have anything about her breed or training or just your thoughts on the dog in general, comment below. <laughs> Um, and there will be more videos coming up, including Nala. Yeah, Nala and Plum. Nala, Plum, Guy and Meg. We're going to sign off now because I feel like I can hear her chewing the table. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.